हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ऑटोमेट्रिक फैंस यूट्यूब चैनल एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर सेइंग दी मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स ऑफ ऑटोमेट्रिक ट्रांसपोजिशन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर सेइंग दी व्हाट इज अ ट्रांसपोजिशन व्हाट आर द प्रोसीजर ऑफ ट्रांसपोजिशन एंड हाउ टू डू अ ट्रांसपोजिशन सो फ्रेंड बिफोर व्हाट इज अ ट्रांसपोजिशन सो ट्रांसपोजिशन इज अ चेंज ऑफ प्रिस्क्रिप्शन पावर चेंज ऑफ प्रिस्क्रिप्शन पावर फ्रॉम वन फॉर्म टू अनदर फॉर्म इज कॉल्ड एज अ ट्रांसपोजिशन इन सिंपल लैंग्वेज Suppose plus form two minus form or minus form two plus form is called as transposition. So friend, now we are seeing the what are the rules of the simple transposition. We are seeing one by one three rules of the transposition. So friend, <coughs> here are the first rule is suppose we have to calculate the spherical power. The first rule is add spherical power plus cylindrical power. There is a first rule. Second rule is change the sign of cylindrical power. We have to change sign of cylindrical power. And third rule is change the axis by 90 degree. Suppose the the degree is less than 90, then we have to add the 90. Or degree is more than the uh, 90, we have to subtract or minus the 90 degree. So friend, now we have to transpose the given example. so transposition already we are seeing the rules of the transposition now we will <coughs> see the rules with the help of example so friend these are the example plus 0.5 diopter sphere plus 1 diopter cylindrical at a 20 degree then the first rule is add sphere plus cylindrical power so here sphere is a plus 0.5 and cylindrical is a plus 1 so we have to add algebraically then the power of sphere is plus 1 plus 0.5 equal to plus 1.5 here we calculated a sphere now we have to calculate cylindrical power then second rule is change the sign of the cylindrical suppose here is a plus sign then i convert it as a minus suppose here is a minus then i return as a plus here and value of the cylindrical power is the same as a above here only we have to change the sign of this cylindrical now we have to calculate the axis or degree of the here is a 20 degree axis so it is less than the 90 so we have to add 90 or suppose it is more than 90 we have to subtract 90 now in example 20 degree means it's less than 90 degree so i have to add it 90 then transpose axis is 110 degree the final transposition power is here Plus 1.5 diopter sphere minus 1 diopter cylindrical at 110 degree. Now, friend, we are seeing the second example of transposition. Minus 1 diopter cylindrical plus 1 diopter sphere plus minus 1 diopter cylindrical spherical plus 1 diopter cylindrical at 90 degree. Now we have to transpose it. The first rule is add sphere plus cylindrical. The value is plus minus the same. The calculation is zero. Then change the sign of cylindrical. Here is a plus sign. We return as a minus, and value will be the same, minus one. Axis is a 90. So uh, only 90. We have to add 90. The axis is a 180 degree. This is a final transposition value. Now we will see the third example of transposition. Minus 0.5 diopter sphere plus 2 diopter cylindrical. At 120 degree axis. So first rule is add sphere plus cylindrical. Here sphere is 0.5 and cylindrical is plus 2. The new sphere power is plus 1.5. Change the sign of this cylindrical. We have to change only sign. Here is a plus sign. I convert it to minus and value should be the same. And degree, it is the more than the 90 degree, so I have to subtract it. 120 minus 90. Here will be a 30 degree. This is a transpose value. Plus 1.5 diopter sphere minus 2 diopter cylindrical at 30 degree. So friend, these are the transposition. It is a very simple calculation. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Optometry Fans YouTube channel.